I'm sick as shit, but let's just do a fucking manga haul. Up first, we got Dragon Ball Super 7, 8, and 9. I normally just get another issue of Dragon Ball whenever I need to, like, need a couple bucks to get an Amazon order in. Uh, I think there's, what, 15 copies out in English? Uh, I probably should know this, because eventually I'm going to run out of things to order, but... Hey, Dragon Ball Super, moving on. Up next is Spy Family Volume 7. I absolutely love the Spy Family series. The anime's recently been airing. My God, it is as good as I hoped it would be. I really can't wait for more volumes to come out. Moving on. After about four months of waiting, we finally got the second volume of Kaiju Number 8. Another fantastic series. If you haven't given Kaiju Number 8 a read yet, I highly recommend it. Up next, Jujutsu Kaisen Volume 15. I fucking hate this dude. And this fucking volume starts off with a heartbreaker. Last but certainly not least for all of my Shonen Jump that I got for the month of April, Sakamoto Days. I absolutely love this series and I'm so happy to finally have it physically. Sakamoto Days, Jujutsu Kaisen, Spy Family, and Kaiju Number no. 8 are all like my favorite Shonen Jump series going on. Arguably, <laughs> Sakamoto Days being the best. I might make a video going more in depth about the series. I genuinely love it and I want more people to read it. If you're gonna pick up anything in this haul today, I highly recommend just get the first volume of Sakamoto Days. And if you don't love it, well, you're wrong. Up next is a bit of a weird one, Young, Alive, and Love. Uh, this series is like, from what I understand, a paranormal rom-com kind of thing. Uh, it's an indie series published by, I forgot what the company is, but I thought I'd give it a try. Uh, the series is only going to be 30 volumes, so if I don't like it, I'll just end up selling these off. Um, but I am genuinely really curious. Support indie manga companies. Why not? Up next is one that I've been needing for way too damn long. Die Dark Volume 1, made by the same author as Dore, Dore Hidoro. Can't pronounce it for shit. I have the second and third volume right behind me, but I just haven't bought the first one. Finally gonna give the series a read, eventually. Probably won't, why would I read the stuff on my shelf? Moving on, Hitomi 3, yeah, I'm not gonna talk about this. <sighs> I don't know why I keep buying the series. I'm gonna keep buying the series. Up next is uh, Nichijou, My Ordinary Life. I've never actually watched it before, but my friend won't shut up about it. I saw it at Barnes and Noble. I was like, all right, screw it. Why not? I'll get it. Uh, yeah, I'll probably read it eventually. I say that about most of these things on the shelf, but I'm not going to read it. Uh, up next is Catch These Hands. Uh, I'm not going to lie. I bought it because I thought the name was funny. Turns out it's about lesbians or something. I'm cool with that though. Shout out to the Luigi Got Big Titties community. Yeah, it's about lesbians or something. I'll probably read it though. I don't mind. You'll never believe what's next. That's right, the thumbnail. The Great Jahi Will Not Be Defeated, Volume 2. This was originally supposed to come out last year, 2021. Can't remember when. Got delayed till January and then it got delayed again in May. Uh, I got delayed again in April, and then it got delayed again, but Right Stuff ended up shipping the order anyways. God, it took way too damn long for the second volume to come out. I like the series. Kind of weird to have on my shelf because... Bad. Good. Bad. Good. Let's just move on, because I don't want to hold this to my face anymore. And last, but certainly not least, yeah, Volume 10, Nagatoro. Uh, this volume starts the tournament arc. No, I'm not joking. Uh, peak Fiction. Uh, read it. Watch it. It has dubbed now. I, I lost what this, my track of time. I'm very sick right now. Uh, yeah, Peak. Well, that about does it for this manga haul. Oh yeah, here's some stuff that I'll be buying. Uh, the My Hero box set is finally coming out. I can't wait to get that. I don't really know where to go with this video, so I'm just gonna end it mid-sentence again. I'm not gonna end it mid-